Yes. Mm -hmm. So let's let's show the positions first, real quick. This new bird. Yeah. Let me go with the position of the bird, right? Your bird. Okay. Back bird. This means you're flipped over on your back, but the head the same way, right? Right. Go ahead. And, uh huh. Now reverse bird means if bird is on your stomach, reverse just means it's not flip. It's just reverse, meaning you're in the reverse direction. This is what's predominantly used in the Aqua community. So it's, at first when I was learning names, I was like, this is stupid. I would just call it whatever the fuck I want to call it. But then, <laughs> but then when you play with a lot of different people like we're doing now, it's nice to have a common language. Now I understand. Yeah, totally. We're, and it's particularly important when, you were, when, when we're communicating. Okay, we're going backward now. And you're like, backward? What the hell is backward? And you, maybe you're thinking this when I'm thinking this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and when two people are thinking two different things, that's when accidents happen, right? Yeah. Just like any type of communication, you've got to be real clear. What is point B? Point B is back bird. Let's get into point B first. This is point B. Leaning back, we want to get here today. Okay? Mm -hmm. Where is point A? We're starting in reverse bird, which means you're over by my head here. You're here. You're here, okay? And we want to get into back bird this way, okay? It's a really pretty flip, very elegant. And easy enough, actually. You'll be able to base uh, this. Let's talk about falls first. Okay, reverse bird. Okay, you're here. We know about reverse bird going over this way. Mm -hmm. We know that. So we're going to keep our legs slightly back, just a little. So there's a Hands fall. Loose. Hands loose. So the legs come back this way. If it's side to side, you know, an easy thing to do is, oh, shit, hold on to the hands, right? right. Watch what you just did. Perfect. You dropped the feet the moment you feel like you're falling. I just as the base try to keep pushing the hands so the pressure comes up. Okay. So drop those feet, that's key. Okay, point B is back fly. Let's check out what the feet are doing, okay? Um, we're starting here. Okay, Sammy, do you want a base camp? Okay, we are here in reverse bird. It's just very similar to Ninja Star. We turn the toes in. Okay, turn the toes in, you take this hand, now it's opposite. It's this foot and this hand is doing most of the pushing. Okay, so you can take this foot off. See that? Yeah. It's mostly there. This hand goes through. Okay. So and now, Kirsten, you hinge here. Make sure you hinge here so there's a, there's a shelf there. And then this foot just simply goes onto the back and you flip back this way. Okay. You catch there. Right? So let's do that one more time. Single. Okay. <laughs> okay, turn. Reverse bird again. Okay, so I keep it basic, right? Okay. Your left leg is stronger, so you'll probably go this way. So let's have you turn your toes in here. Hinge at the leg there. Here's the good. You can bend it light or you can just drop whichever feels good for you, right? Now we have this opposite thing going. It's this hip and this hand. So that allows you to let go of here, right? Remember, you can fall, this is reverse, same thing as reverse, but you can fall this way really fast. So if you feel like you're falling this way, what do you do? You drop, just like most anything, you drop your feet, you push your hands up. Okay, try to get them upright. No holding onto the hands, open support. You drop your feet, you'll be safe. Okay, drop those feet. One more time. Reverse bird. We're going to hinge here, turn that toe in. Opposites, right? And find that balance first. And then watch this foot here. She's going to keep this hinge so you have a shelf. You just trace this along her back. Try to go horizontal. Okay. That's going to be easier for you to catch. And then you can switch the feet over. Okay. And it's always pushing on the opposite stuff when you're going on one hip. Let's say I'm going on this hip. Where, where am I pushing off? I'm pushing off the opposite hand. Okay. That's where the two points of balance comes, right? We're turning back to reverse bird. Hey, let's watch it one more time. We're hinging in. She's providing a shelf, right? You don't need to hinge all the way, but at least just at least enough to where this foot is not sliding off, right? Now we're pushing off the opposite, really strong arm. This arm wants to go down like this. Yeah. That will not help you fly. Push that up as strong as you can. Connect here. Let her bring this foot first. Be careful kicking on the face, okay? Yes. Bring this foot over, and she's just going to do a back flip here. Watch that foot sideways here first, so you have that one balance, and then you can replace the feet there. Down, Kirsten. Kirsten, let's have you 